Hang tight, people. Rubluffian. Unlocking the game. Here we go. Let's see. No. The best of decks. At least I can see my thing. Bear with me, the first time I've used this system as well as played this game, but I got an understanding. Ah, oh, there we go. No problem, I'm very helpful. I just hope I can see my hand when I'm... Yes! Okay. I'm trying something crazy that might work. <laughs> trying something crazy, alright. Last time I did a video... Ooh, oh well. Oh, there it is. Last time I did a video, some people, um, on Octagon, people were saying, like, oh, it's too far away. And the video was fuzzy, so. On copy of main character. You do. But it's ready, so. Oh wait, do I want a mulligan in my hand? Let's see. Um, take a mulligan. I don't have any pink in my hand, so I might as well. Go to six. <sighs> well, this is a hand, isn't it? Dice. On oh, a six sided die? Okay, you want to do six sided? I got three. <laughs> well! Shoot. I'll go first. So, click on here. F1. Are you the first player? Yes. I have two action tokens. Now I'm in my main phase. Let's see, what am I going to do? I have Flitter, High Spirits, an Alizotl, Lyra, Fluttershy Guidance Counselor, and Downright Dangerous. Hmm. Since I don't know what he's going to do, and I don't have any critters, I'm just going to pay one to drop Flitter. And then go. I don't want to do an early I was Odo unless I really know he's going for something. Hmm, this person might be really new, so it's like, uh... Odd oh, tab to... Tab doesn't want to work? Um... Hmm. Does tab usually do it? <laughs> I gotta try that out, but, uh... I guess you could use, a uh, Use, uh, I guess, uh... Use the F1. To go through the steps. Ah! Or just... 
to go through the, I guess, uh, go through the... F1, or keys. Phase? Okay, I can't spell. Keys. Uh, two days to win Flash Sentry. What? Oh, wow. I may want to do that. I never got Flash Sentry. So the dance game pony is <laughs> Flash Sentry. Okay. He's at his main phase. We got Emergency Dress Order, and we got Bunny Breakout. And he's using Rarity. Or my opponent is using Rarity. I'm using Fluttershy Beastmaster. I need to actually try this deck out with the Candlelight Knights Fluttershy, because... Uh, uh, my deck can easily run both of them. I only use one, because this one's... I'm just more used to this one. But with a hand like this, it can get kind of hard to do what I want to do. I can't really flip her yet. But even with the other one, I couldn't flip her anyway. I technically could, I guess, next turn. Does nothing, okay. Oh, and I do the- and I top deck the Falcon. Yes. Troublemaker phase, nothing. Main phase. I can do a flip. One. To set down Falcon. And then two. To move Fluttershy up to my problem. Score phase. I get two points, one for the bonus. And then, oh, right click. Flip. <laughs> yeah, a turn two flip, ladies and gentlemen. I should probably have music on right now. I want to have like appropriate music, really. I probably have some uh, ready for next time. Crazy me too. Mrs. Cup is ready to play. Thank you for telling me. Uh, but Fluttershy is easily one of the best mains in the entire game because of her effect, or or Beastmaster's effect. Although the Candlelight Knights Fluttershy did win at um, Big Apple Con, Big Apple Pony Con. Okay, he's in his main phase. He saved his token, so he has he has five tokens. That's right, because I have points. So he went from two to five, and he has a hand size of eight. He minus. Ooh, nah, I can't do that. Whoa, what the hell? Whoa. What? Wait, what happened? <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> What the what the what? I work with the either or the deck works for both. Ignore Luna, apparently I can't decide between the two. Oh, oh, okay, I see what he did. Oh, um well, you're supposed to just choose one for the deck. Um, you're supposed to load one- oh. Oh, I get it. <laughs> but, um, but you can't do that. Do that either way. Cheerly! Thank you. Um, uh, you need two magic on the, you need two magic on the board to get the twi that twilight out. Uh, 
I know I'll have to make separate decks now. We'll both main changes. Magicon. Magicon! Um, in real life you can, but, um, you might as well make a deck with one or the other. You have to have two magic on the board to, ha to get Twilight out. You're using Rarity. Yeah, even if he, even if Luna was on there, and he's using the Camelot Knights Luna, or was, yeah. Which, actually, that would have been really better. There he goes. So, yeah, plus one, because she wouldn't mind, so yeah, that's two, and then two to move. Okay. Okay, let's see, he had five action tokens, so that minus two or three minus two for one, um, now that's two, yes. I meant points. I had five, yeah. No, you, you subtracted, right? Yeah, I said, I said, yeah, now that's two points. And rarity flips, because you got two points in the score phase. Uh, you pay plus one to move a character to this card's problem. Oh, <laughs> 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 I have enough. Mm. No, I have three action tokens. That would take all my action tokens. Okay. What else can I do? I can do a Downright Dangerous. I can put an owl on that problem and then do a Downright Dangerous because then Flitter would have to to do blue moon or why are heartstrings is ready to play <laughs> she's right here um or i could see he might go for the double face off next turn but i don't know should i It would cost two to yeah. It would cost two to move, and then plus one to move would be three. Yeah, I'm sorry. Uh, main phase. Uh, that's only two points. That's only two power. If I do one and one, and then I would have one to do nothing. I wanted to set an Alizotl. I could I could Alizotl her right now, but I or him. I, I'm assuming it's a dude that I'm playing against, but I think I can get Fluttershy Guidance Counselor out. I think I'll do that. Play. <sighs> yeah, I think that's the best thing to do, because then I'm going to exhaust it anyway. So, score phase. I get one point. Minus. Because I can't fucking spell.
to 3 minus 1. Okay, cool. Uh, looked at one card and put 0 on top and 1 on the bottom. <laughs> at least he knows how to inspire. I actually don't really know how to inspire in this game. I guess he already did that. Or maybe the game did it for him, because it looks like... No, because it like sets... Yeah. He would have had four to deal with this one, because he saved one, but... Um... I put him down to... <laughs> I made him... I had to make sure he went down! Hmm. <laughs> Fluttershy is too good. Begins their score phase, gets a point. So he's gonna pass the turn to me in a second. It's now my turn. Draw oh drawing into that double forest owl. Thank you, Lord. <laughs> Let's see, he hasn't played anything, so he's saving his action tokens. All I really need to do is play Forest Owl and then go into the double face-off. Which is what I'll do. Save my two action tokens for next turn. So I'm going to put Forest Owl on the table, which grants Fluttershy an extra one. So now she's four, which I will need to confront the problem. So now... That's my phase. Score phase... I get two points, one for each problem. And now double face off. Boom. <laughs> Cause they don't really have any effects that would minus any power, so. Oh! I was flip. I win! Because <laughs> it's just more. Oh man, so that's 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 15, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Wow! Alright, so I get 1 point. 15 versus 9, you won. Yeah. <laughs> uh, move to bottom up deck. Whoa. I didn't mean that. Replace a problem. It's kind of weird. Um. Ah! So this one, and this one. <laughs> and I need to end my turn. <laughs> A problem effect. Moves Falcon. Moves Owl. Yep. Uh, the problem says when this problem is played, the owner may move one of their critters uh, here from home for free. And then Falcon says when you move this card to a problem, you may move one of your critter friends to that problem for free. Owl gives power. Yeah. Yeah. And Falcon, if moved, gets the ability. I just explained it! <laughs> but it says when this problem is played! It's when... The problem... 
it happens in the score phase. Because... Because it says is played. It happens in the score phase because it says when the problem is played. As soon as it flips. It's a chain of effects. That's what it is. So basically, it's just a cheap way of saying I already have cards uh, on there. <laughs> it's not illegal. It happens because it's as soon as it's flipped. And it's not a starting problem, so there's no way you would start with it. So when this problem is played, the owner may move one of their critter friends fr here from home for free. It says when you move this card to a problem. Yeah. I did. The problem lets me move it. The problem lets me move it. I swear, it's legal! Yeah, the problem does. Did not see that. I thought you used a home effect. Oh. <laughs> oh, no, no. Oh. Yeah, that's what I was saying. He he thought it was all through Falcon. No, 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 no. No, it's not through Falcon. It's through, um, yeah, no. The problem says I can move it. Then Falcon's effect. Then I moved Falcon, and then Falcon moved Owl. And he's going to inspire again. It didn't really help him. <laughs> it really didn't. Because, let's see, I need three. I already have two there, so... Oh, man, I forgot to exhaust Fluttershy. I need six. Yes. To do that one. During their main phase, they made a special knife answer to game one. Not a really good card. I really don't like that one. And it has two bonus. This one has two bonus, too, so I guess we're equal. I missed it. Keep going. I'm penalizing myself. <laughs> I'm penalizing myself. Uh, I need three. Which I could have. Yeah, I'm penalizing myself, so. I mean, it's what would happen in tournaments, really, so. Let's uh, move a little closer. I know I know they're not entirely good to see. So yeah, I have Falcon. This is one of the best problems, I think, because, you know, move. It's like screams, it's for Falcon. Alright. Yeah, he goes like I is like I know he's trying to be nice, but He has nine cards in his hand. That's oof. I gotta keep. I gotta keep an eye. See if he uh, if he skips his turn. I'm gonna have to say like, uh, your hand's too big. You have to discard one card. And this is the first time. And with his this being his first time on the system or on this uh, platform, it's like I don't know, like it's it's totally okay. And I'm really, <laughs> I really should have had music going on with this. I should have done that, really. Because he has seven action tokens now. He's, that's insane. He could do a lot. And I wonder why he's not doing anything. We didn't disconnect, I hope. Oh. Marvelous Chapeau on Blue Moon. Okay. 
cool. Minus one, yes. Uh, when the surround is an opponent's pawn, if they have at least three yellow, yeah, he has to move it. There he goes. If he has three, I mean three um, generosity in play. Oh, in play, they need plus one. That's fine. That's. It's fine. And he still has four. I mean, even if I did have to be a flood he would have six. So it's like, that's just still a lot. Okay. Let's hope I can get out of this, guys. Um, six to three. Not too much of a lead, but... And I don't even know if I can do I Need Nanthers. It depends on what he's going to play. He hasn't, really, he hasn't really played much. Um, how does the face-off work? It has to be at least two on both of them. Uh, you have to meet the requirements for both for a, uh, for both problems. Uh, Uh, you had to meet the requirements for both problems. You had to have them. You had to have everything you need on both sides of your board, and then you can go into a double face off, regardless of what your opponent has, which is how I was doing it. Oh, he needs minus one. That's right. So he only needs five. Well, there he goes, yeah. Twilight Sparkle. Nice. Uh, it needs to go minus three, though. With that combat hat. <sighs> wow, making it really difficult. Oh, but it's four, yeah. So he's using all of his action tokens to just... Make it hard on me, why don't you? Wow. So now I can't move to this one unless... Oof. But, I have a plan. Because of score phase, he has not really met any of them, so... What? No. You don't have enough to meet it. You need five. Mm, no, you haven't met any requirements. No, you haven't met any requirements. You need three. Yeah, you need three. And yeah. You need one more purple and then two of anything. You haven't met any requirements. For any of them. You need five. He only has two. But it says as long as I have three white in play. Oh, that's a typo. Oh, no, that's a typo. That's a typo on the card. It's supposed to say minus one. Uh. They fixed it for Canterlot Knights, but not for the... They fixed it for Canterlot Knights, but not for this. Yeah. No, 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 no. That, that... Can I, can I take back my play, then? <laughs> or change it a bit? Ah, oh, sure. <laughs> Because, um, I don't know if we, uh, I don't know if that combat hat was really what he wanted to play, really. 
I mean, sure. I'll allow it. Um, yeah, I was like, oh, I was going to like, wait, he needs like five. <laughs> yeah. Oh my God. Yeah. When you're super new. That's how you know you're super new to this game. Wow. He actually thought. I'm sorry, that, that that has to be pointed out. I know it doesn't really say it, but um, if you don't know, this card has been eroded or changed to say minus one. It was always supposed to say minus one, but for some reason it didn't print on the first run of the series. Oh, it's just going to take back Twilight. And the combat hat. I don't know why. Sets... Oh, so yeah, he took back the four action tokens. Is he going to take back uh, Marvelous Chapeau? Probably not. No. He's still doing it. Yeah, there he goes. There you go! Move it for two and steal it. There you go. I always applaud my opponent for making, like, the right plays. It's like, there you go. Because <laughs> I saw it, because I'm like, that's five? That... Yeah. yeah. That's much better. Now I know. Sorry, I didn't see the minus. It's not on there. Interplay just forgot to print it. And the problem. <laughs> It's not that you, yeah, it's not that you don't see it, it's just that that's what it's supposed to say. Because <laughs> if it, if it, uh, yes. Yes, you stole my problem. You dang darn it, you. You dang to darn it. Um, no. No, because I had to meet the, I had to meet my requirements, so... Yeah, it goes up to his three points. I can steal his, too. I could easily steal his. Ah, so both sides have to be required. I get it now. Yep. Yeah, well, for a, for a singular face-off... Yeah. Let's see. Ooh! <laughs> Responsibility pie. So mean. Let's see, I have six. I can use four to move Fluttershy, both Fluttershy's to this one. Easily solve it. That'll leave me two left over. Hmm. I can do one to do high spirits and then wait till next turn. Because we get four action tokens per turn, so if I leave one... Then my next play would be, yeah. I think that would be best. Because then, I only need two there. And then I could play my next, yeah. Okay, so. Uh, uh. Main phase. Unless he goes for the double face off. He has two action tokens. But I'm going to use Fluttershy's effect. Hmm. <laughs> He has a, he has he's been very conservative and he has a full hand so but I think this is the best thing to do two to move two to move and then probably one to play. High spirits, I guess. I could play it on that problem, but I don't really need it. I I want to play Pinkie Pie next turn, so I want to play high spirits. And just in case he goes into a double face off, I need something. So score phase, I get three points. One, two, three. Because that's like six. That's three for us. <laughs> And is that it? Yeah. Mm. 
So I stole your problem. Yeah, it's four action tokens. <laughs> I was like, oh, double click! Now he has five action tokens! Because <laughs> he saved two, so... Yeah. Gotta keep him... Inspired, put one on top and zero on bottom. So it's probably my other forest owl. He wants to get into my... Yeah. <laughs> he probably knows he wants to get into a face-off and he's like, ah, oh, no, 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 no. And I always have to back up uh, I was auto play. So he's inspired and he's decided to leave my card on top. I can only assume it's the forced owl because flipping off zero face offs is just bad. And I don't know if he could do everything he wants to do with just five. I know because well because of the misplay that I let happen or let him take back. He has, I know he has Twilight Sparkle in his hand. I've known that, really. And he also has Combat Hat. I do kind of wish I had my Critical Cavalry. It'd be the, it'd be the best reason. And maybe that's what he, uh, well, he's a new player, so he probably wouldn't know what it does. Hmm. Begins their score phase. Oh, just goes for the point. He can't do anything <laughs> nice. Yeah! Flitter! Nice! God, wrong who? Wrong move? Moves question to discard pile. Now what? Oh! Oh, big hand. <laughs> I forgot. Uh, right, 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 right. Um, turn maker phase, main phase, let's see. That's right. Then my bottle play. <laughs> well, I mean, I do have my five action tokens, and I have the two required. So I ended up to safe points, and I ended, and I mislooked. Oh, okay. Okay. Watch this. <laughs> One, two, three, four. For that one. And then shift. There you go. Cool. <laughs> That's how you target. Oh, dismissed, dude. Dismissed. Dismissed! Which means to the discard pile! No, to the discard pile. No, it means to the discard pile. Both go to the same place. It's all the same. Retired goes to the discard pile, dismissed goes to the discard pile. They both refer to the same place. Just one you do yourself, the other one is forced by your opponent. 
And then we'll move our thing. We don't have enough. We have uh, two. But I do have another four cell. <laughs> Let's see, what would I have? I have five, one, two. I would have way too many, but I wouldn't need uh, uh, four style. We have too much. Just too much. 10, 11. One for both. Another double face off. <laughs> oh, my deck. Um, it's regardless, and it... <laughs> it's regardless. Well, both sides on my side of the board. All right, let's face off flip. <laughs> uh, it's, it's about to be 25. My three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, eighteen to three, four, five, probably. Move to bottom. Ah, I get to search my deck. I get to search my deck. Look at all cards. Uh, for a critter? Ooh, yeah, that's right. I don't have any equals. Oh, one sec. Close and shuffle. And I have to dismiss, so I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven to my home. I'm going to... I can't do too much. Um, t -t 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 move to discard pile. Ah, it's so hard. Well, I already have the two required. I have another flitter, so I think I'll move to discard. So that's one, two, three, four, five. I need to dismiss one more. Which, I'm sorry to say, it has to be one of the Forest Owls. Oh, man. So now I am ready. Oh, and I got two ones. Forgot to add the bonus. Could have kept five. Oh, wait, did I miscount? Oh, shoot, oh, shoot, I miscounted. Oh, shoot, I miscounted. Well, I mean, I put the fucking four style back. Okay. <laughs> I had to bring the forest owl. I mean, I, I, I probably did, could have done flitter, but I already have another flitter in hand, so that's fine. And I can still do the Daring Dangerous next turn, regardless. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah. I was like, I know she doesn't count. I know she doesn't. It's just me. Dang it. Oh. 
And that. And that! <laughs> he has 10 action tokens. There you go, yeah. He has to minus one anyway. And it's like, and that. But nine action tokens and nothing to do, really, dude? Because, like, all I gotta do is, like, uh, meet one of these problems and y'all screwed. Them. Oh, shoot. It's a big shot. When Troublemaker. Hmm. I can say it's white and purple. White and purple isn't a bad combination, but um, being a first-time player, it's... What did he do? Wait. Uh, he moves... Question mark. It doesn't know it's Big Shot? I guess he doesn't know it's Big Shot. And... He... Yeah. He needs to go down, too. There you go. Minus four. Okay, so he's doing it all at once. There he goes. That's three, four, five. God. Oh my lord! Well, I don't even need to get to your pro- Dude, I know what you're doing, but... Your problem is actually self-sufficient, too. So I would need plus two to move to that problem? No thanks, I'll try this one. <laughs> it's like, mine is tempting because of the three bonus, but yours is okay. <laughs> and I only need two points anyway, so even a starting problem would have been good. I forget, I, I forget I'm in my troll micro phase too. <laughs> now he's like, oh no, now I get to... It doesn't matter, really, because I'm going to win next turn. Ray Gluflix is spectating, is he not? Yes, he is. He put it at the bottom. But we're not going to get into a face-off, because I'm going to win. Unless he does something with his four action tokens, which he can do. Okay. One exhaust. Get high spirits. I have eagle. What do? It's like, it's only six. I can double move and win the game. I didn't even have to play Alizoto. Alizoto was just a oh shit moment. Alizoto was more of an oh shit. One, two, to move. One, two to move. Unless he has standstill. I totally, I totally blanked on if he had standstill. <laughs> Gorefrays. And that's game. <laughs> 